Hey, what's happening? This is Spot Too Tight. Back with another tutorial, this time for Cubase 10.5. Um, a lot of you guys have been following me. No, I'm a Heavy Studio One user and MPC user. Um, but most recently, I switched over to Cubase 10. Um, they had a lot of features that I was looking for to speed up my workflow. And it was a good move at that. Um, but on top of that, man, I found out a way... Uh, for us Cubase users to chop our samples up and sample directly in Cubase just like an MPC um, hitting the pad um, as we feel we want to place our own chops instead of chopping it up by the transients or by the grid we can do a manual way of uh, chopping up our samples per hitting the pad just like we do an MPC machine Cubase has that functionality so I'm just going to give you a quick walkthrough to set up your Cubase DAW um, that way you can start chopping up MPC style directly in Cubase using Groove Agent 5. Now there's just a few quick steps that you want to set up in Cubase um, so that Groove Agent is going to be able to detect and read the incoming signal um, from the audio source that you're recording from that you want to sample. Uh, so the first thing you want to do is make sure that your audio ports are set up correctly. You want to set the channel up as an audio source. Um, I have mine um, coming from my MPC touch and I have that routed to my sound card that way I can capture uh, my audio and chop it up directly in Cubase. So that's set up. I'll add a track. We'll add an audio track and I'll select my MPC for my internet audio. And you want to make sure that we monitor the signal. So anything that I play in my MPC it's going to channel up in Cubase. Alright, so now that the signal is there, next I'll pull up Groove Agent. And what we want to do now is set up a sidechain input of the input source that we're going to capture. Uh, so here we'll click on Add Sidechain Input. And that's my Audio 1, uh, my MPC. I didn't name it as an MPC channel, but that's where the sound source is coming from. Um, so I click on it to select it. And next you want to click on Activate Sidechain and that'll turn to a little orange color to make sure it's activated there. And to make sure the sound is coming in. And before you try to start capturing anything in Groove Agent, be sure and click the record button on Groove Agent. I've already have mine set to record. Um, if it's not set to red, it's not recording. Alright, so the next thing we want to do is set up Groove Agent uh, to be able to capture the pad as I'm hitting the pads, each pad going across MPC style. Um, in the MPC, you know, we can manually chop our samples going into the system and the Cubase is set up the same way with Groove Agent the way I have it triggered and set up. So on the Groove Agent you want to set your sample mode to Auto Next and the start you want to select MIDI Note On. Use the drop down and select MIDI Note On and for the stop keep that on MIDI Note On as well. That way when you hit the next pad it'll capture the next sample so forth, pad 1, pad 2, pad 3, pad 4, and so forth, all the way up to um, all 8 banks if you want to go all the way across. Um, some of us just capture 16, but if you want to capture all 8 banks, it'll just keep going um, to 4, um, group 5, group 6, group 7, group 8, and you can capture all of the pads as the sample is going in. And I'll play the track again just so you can see an example of how I started it. So I'm going to press play on my MPC because that's where my audio source is coming from. And you'll see the sound coming in to Groove Agent. And I'll hit the pads as I'm capturing the sample and coming in.
Well, hope this helps out. Um, you know, it is possible to do MPC style chopping in Cubase. I just wanted to uh, bring it to everyone's attention. If you know it already, great. Uh, but for a lot of Cubase users who are looking for other alternatives to chop like an MPC, you can do it right here in Cubase on Groovation 5. Hope this works out. And as always, please like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. Until next time, you guys keep it tight. Peace.